guys, what's going on? T Blake here. Today I'm bringing you a very special review. This is a shoe I've been looking for for a very long time. Uh, not only that, it has original everything, which is hard to come by. I'm sharing with you the Jordan 5 Sunset. It's a women's shoe. Jordan brand stopped making women's shoes a while ago, and Nike brand uh, stopped producing women's shoes in size 13. So a lot of Roshi runs that I've liked, I just can't pick up. Uh, but in my opinion, this is probably the best colorway of a Jordan 5, and I don't say that lightly. Let's get into it. All right, there it is. Women's Air Jordan 5 Retro, white, red sunset, dark cinder. You'll notice again, size 13. Now this extra sticker here, this was actually purchased from Flight Club. Uh, I did not buy this from Flight Club, though the seller that I got it from uh, sold me it from Flight Club, included the original receipt and everything. Yeah, so if you really want to impress me doing business, I mean, original receipt, original retro card. I wish they Jordan would keep putting retro cards back in. It, it, it's kind of a shame. It's such a simple touch, but it, it goes a long way. It's nice having them. Bang. Bang. Man, this colorway is just so fuego, it's not even funny. Um, I'm going to show you some of the close-up details, but just overall, I mean, between the, the fighter jets hit, you know, here with that cinder and orange and that pearly white, you just can't beat right, it. So you got a very high-quality plush leather, nothing like the plasticky leather we've seen on some other Jordan 5s. Got the white midsole with a white air unit there all white earth thing but then you come to these nice beautiful sunset and cinder hints and you'll notice this is one of the most unique soles of any Jordan shoe I've had it's it's a translucent sort of Hawaiian punch colored so you know these aren't gonna yellow these are gonna stand up well much like the bread 11's very similar you see here you got the red jump man in the back the Air Jordan logo printed in orange. Another nice touch. I mean, this orange you just don't see on Jordan shoes, and when you do, it's not done very well. Now, I got these for $170 shipped, which is a complete steal in my opinion. You'll notice the Jumpman's 100% intact. White stitching around the toe box. We got the white laces in there. The lace lock is that beautiful orange color, which mimics the Jumpman. Might have been a jump woman, considering this is women's sizing, but they keep it the same. Well guys, there you have it. I'm about to lace these up, cue up the music, and put it on feet. If you enjoyed this review so far, hit that like button for me. Also, let me know down in the comments what your favorite Jordan 5 model is. Ready? Go. Dirty money. Dirty money.